Who is the freebie guy? Walmart clearance. This is my second video today of clearance at Walmart. Look at this. I found this ride on toy for just $25. Regular, a hundred bucks. Christmas clearance. Right now, Hobby Lobby has all their Christmas decor at 66% off. Hi, I'm Kendall, also known as the freebie guy, and this is my history in motion. This is kind of crazy. It's, it's a lot smaller than I remember. It seems like the front yard was bigger. It's just kind of crazy that this is where it was, that this is kind of where it started. We had Christmas a couple years and it was all done by the church, all the toys were. Um, there was one time when I was a kid and we lived here, not at this house, but here in Corsicana, where we didn't, we didn't have anything. And I woke up on Christmas day and there was nothing. The freebie guy is, everything I would have wanted as that little kid in that house. That is what it is. A guy gives stuff away, shows you how to get to crazy deals. When I was a little kid, I would go to garage sales and I would just try to bargain with everybody to get the best deal possible and it was a game. The freebie guy is all of that stuff that I would have wanted and I, it didn't exist and I made it into a made it into a person. This is when like, I really got, like when I have a special message or something, this goes on. When I do a spin and win giveaway, it's the freebie guy suit that goes on. And I had it custom made because it's the freebie guy. Free samples was something I obviously always liked as a kid. I, I wanted to get mail. Um, as I started learning the internet and social media, I would see like some companies doing samples on, um, on like I would see them on my Facebook feed, like get a free sample of duct tape. What? That speaks to me. So I wanted a free sample of duct tape. Like sign me up, let's, let's get it. And I started, um, after, I was claiming those before I had a website. I started finding sweepstakes online like on my Facebook feed. They would be like, comment if you want to win. And no one believed they were real, so people weren't really entering. And there wasn't a huge competition of people entering them. And so I was entering and I was winning stuff. I won a trip to Puerto Vallarta, Mexico. I went to Mexico for free. I won a 50 inch flat panel TV from a company. I won patio furniture. I won iPads. I won gift cards. And I was getting all this stuff free. I started following like some Facebook pages that did, um, that had free samples. And one I really liked was called Julie's Freebies. It ended up in a situation where it was going to be deleted. And I offered to take that Facebook page over. It had like 4,000 or so followers on it. I built a website. I did all of it. I kind of knew how to do a website and I built the website and I started doing free samples. And that's kind of how it started was just free stuff. Samples as time went on started becoming more infrequent. As more people were claiming them, companies were doing less of them. So I started, I'm like, well, I want all this stuff. We'll add in sweepstakes. So I started adding in sweepstakes on it. I started giving away stuff on it and it, had, it, it blew up. All these clucks I got right here were one cent a piece. And everyone always asks when I get a big haul, they're like, what are you gonna do with all that stuff? What are you gonna do with all that stuff? So the clocks, I made a clock wall. And I need to go find more clearance clocks to finish it out. But all of these clocks right here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. It was eleven cents for all of them. It's so cliche, and it's so hard to understand when you're a kid or when you're struggling, and someone tells you you can be anything you want to be. That is, it's cliche. Like I heard that as a kid, and I was like, mm. you can. I. I did this, like I, I'm, I made a character, I became it and I made a living doing it without a, an educational background to do that. You really can be anything you want to be and you, you just put your mind to it, you work, you work, you work. You're gonna get told no, things are not gonna go your way. Some days are a struggle, some days I'm, I'm not having great days, some days it's super stressful, some days I just wanna cry, but that's part of doing something. If you want to do something, do it and keep doing it. And you can be anything you want to be. You really, you really can, as cliche as that sounds, look at me. I mean, I, I did this. It's kind of 
it blows me away every day. Like I, every single day, I think I say, I cannot believe this is real life.